Hello family, welcome back to the channel. This is Anthony and I'm here with the Dollar Tree haul. First I'd like to apologize, I don't know what happened to uh, the audio part of this video. So for the first, uh, I'd say at least 22 minutes, there is no uh, audio. So I had to go on and do a voiceover for this video. This is the first time I've done this, so please bear with me. So first here I'm, share, I'm sharing with you some dish towels that I picked up. Uh, this is part of the new collection that Dollar Tree has. Uh, they have uh, the red with the black and gr uh, the gray and white checkered as well as they have a navy blue with the gray and black check and they have some dishes that I saw that were red with white in the inside of uh, the cups. I just showed you another uh, dish towel. It is like a tea towel. I liked it because of the red. These here are some microfiber washcloths that my husband picked up. You get four in the package. And um, yeah, I don't know what he picked them up for, but he grabbed those. I did grab a couple of uh, Christmas clearance items. This here is the tablecloth that I picked up. And it has the hot cocoa drinks and stuff, which matches uh, my cocoa station that I put up this past year. So I grabbed that. And then I also grabbed these cute little uh, gingerbread treat bags. And those were also 50 cents. So, let's see what I got next coming up here. I picked up some of the burner covers. I picked up two packages of these. This is a new print at my Dollar Tree. Live every moment with joy and laughter. Love the color. Uh, I have an issue with turning on the stove without removing the cover, so I end up burning them up. So, I had to pick up... Uh, two more packages. You get a large one and a small one in the package. So I needed two. As you see, there's a small one on the back. So yeah, I got those. Next up, let's see. I picked up one of the mugs that I was talking about it's the white in the inside but these are part of the new dishware set that I seen at my Dollar Tree so I just got it to add to my collection of mugs it would be cute for Valentine's Day okay I know something's coming I picked up these, uh, oh, these are some cute little trinket, little trinket boxes. They're ceramic, and these were the only two I saw, but I thought they were really pretty. This one here has the gold top, and then this one has the mint green top. I think I will be putting these in my bedroom, probably, uh, to hold extra little jewelry and things like that, but they're really cute. If I don't use them in there, I will definitely use them in my craft space and storage some things in there. They're nice and heavy, nice and chunky, good quality, so they're worth the dollar. Let's see, what else did I get? You can see I... Um, new to this it runs slower than the pictures coming up so I did pick up a couple food items I picked up those uh, orange mandarin orange cups you get three in a package they are a repurchase and I also grabbed this Amos 4d gummy candy they're mini fast foods they come with the hamburger the french fries and uh, the drink actually uh, so I picked those up for my hubby. He did eat them already, and he liked them. So grab those. I think those are the only food items that I picked up in this haul. Oh, let's see. 
Okay, I did get some books. This one here is a workbook. I picked it up for the girls, but I, I'm going to have to go online and find the companion book that goes with it. There, This is the workbook. I'm a little out of frame there, but it's uh, getting there, a workbook for growing up. It's really a nice book. Uh, I forget the price offhand. Um, I don't know. I may show it. Um, but yeah, it's a cute book. Uh just need to find the actual book to goes, that goes along with it. Also, in this haul, I picked up a couple of uh, books, uh, crafty books, uh, felt making books. I guess now I'm flipping through some of the pages in the the workbook. Um, yeah, so I got that for the girls. I thought it was a nice book for a dollar. So the crafty books I picked up were... Uh, for uh, crafting with felt so I picked up this first one here to add to my collection I think but it shows different projects in there that you can use felt for like this flower the uh, purse on the front they made little flowers and embellished the front of the purse there are templates and things in the back of the book for the projects Excuse me, but it is a really, really nice book. Oh, Y'all bear with me. If you've seen the uh, first video, I was talking about my eye as an update in the end of the video. So I'm laying here face down. Actually, I'm on my side right now with my head down trying to do this voiceover but this book here it's let's get crafty fabric and felt i picked that up for my grandkids it's for ages two and up i think it said two and up uh, but there's a few of the pages some really cute uh projects to do with your children um there are also templates and things in the back of this book yeah, so that's great for young kids to do some craft projects with. So I grabbed that for them to send, most likely in their box for this month, for January. I wanted to get it out to them before surgery, but I didn't get a chance to get it together. So I will send that to them. I did pick up a few of the new Jot stickers. The one I just showed were the hearts. And I believe you get 33 stickers in each package. Those are the ice creams and popsicles, and there's some fruit on there. Really pretty. And then this next one here is like a birthday theme. You get the hearts, balloons, banners, um, there's bowls. Super cute. And this next one is a unicorn theme. I really love those pastel colors. And then they have like a silver accent. All of them really do. Uh, and they're really cute. So this here is a cute little journal. Um, and actually I picked it up. Oh, my battery's low. Hopefully I can get through this voiceover. Uh, I picked it up to use it as a template. It's just like the little uh, traveler's notebooks that we used to make all the time with the laminated cover and the elastic uh, band. This one comes with two little notebooks in the inside with lined paper. And the covers of those notebooks are like a craft paper. But I thought that was super cute, so I grabbed that. This is a weekly calendar my husband picked up for 2021. Uh, so he wanted that, so he got it. These are some cute little, uh, puppy page flags. I thought those would be great for my, my dog journals. And they are by Crown Jewels. I don't remember how many are in there, but I think there's a hundred actually, like 25, 
each of each doggy. So just little page markers. And then we have some fabric. I picked up, uh, I think, three of those uh, Crafter Square fabric. That one there is a black and white print with little doggies on it, which I will be using for journal covers, as well as this turquoise bandana printed uh, fabric. These fabric rolls seem larger than the ones that, that first came out. They were little fat quarters, and I think there's more here. Not for sure, but it looks like more. This last one here is a floral print. I thought that would be great for some spring journals or even some of the prayer prayer journals that I make. So I grabbed those three. And what's next? Oh, I guess I'm still talking about the the fabric there. But, yeah, those are really nice. I did pick up one of these jade uh, face roller things to massage the face, uh, get the blood flowing and stuff. Uh, this one is larger than the one that I had previously purchased. It's by Sassy and Chic, or Sassy and Chick. Um, yeah, I do have a smaller one. I think I'll probably give a smaller one to one of the girls, and I'll get that, take that larger one. These are some rat tail. We call them rat tail combs. Um, that's what I learned to call them growing up, but they're great for parting the hair. Um, when you're putting a relaxer in your hair, uh, they're great to part and rub the relaxer at, from the root up. But I was happy to see Dollar Tree... Uh, had those in and it is a two pack so a great deal usually if I pick them up at the the beauty supply stores I pay like a dollar I think or 99 cents for one and here is another package of combs these are the spiral combs um, you can use that uh, metal tip the same way as the plastic one over there so I grabbed those My husband grabbed some tooth toothbrushes. Y'all forgive me for yada. It's just it's long been a long long couple of days. Um, but he grabbed some Colgate toothbrushes. You get one for free in there, and they are the soft bristle uh, toothbrushes. But it's great to always have some uh, extra toothbrushes on hand, especially if you get sick with a cold or something. You you need to uh, switch them out. You should be switching them out anyway. Um, I'd say probably every month, if not sooner. But if you get sick in between there, I would switch them out. Um, I did just show the unicorn tape dispenser, which was so cute. And then those are some Curad alcohol pads. I picked up two boxes of those. Uh, they're alcohol prep pads. I got one for my mom and one for our home. And you get 100 pads in the package. So those are nice to add to a first aid kit. Here I'm showing some Lady Speed Stick. I like to pick that up at Dollar Tree. I got two different scents. Uh, I forget what that one was. Um, and then here is the other one. I can't see... Uh, what they say as far as the scent. I think they're 1.7 ounce containers of deodorant. But those are a repurchase. I like that you don't get the uh, the white uh, deodorant residue on your clothing. So I always grab those. Uh, what else is coming up here? Oh, the Bolero. Uh, our Dollar Tree has got in a lot of the new Boleros. So I picked up this, uh, uh, what is it, the lotion? Um, yeah, I grabbed that. What is it, the t Tangerine, I think. I'm sorry, y'all, I can't see it. Um, but anyway, I got two products. I was looking for the body wipes 
which is new, but my Dollar Tree had not got them in when I was last in Dollar Tree. And they didn't even have any of the regular facial wipes out. Uh, but I did pick up these. These were new. They're Unks Professional. Um, they're felt wipes. And I open them up. They say extra thick, which they don't look extra thick once I take them out the box. Um, I think you get 25 in the box of those. But they're great for removing uh, makeup, a fingernail polish remover, and stuff. So I have them... Uh, I picked up that box to see. See, here's one I take took out of the box. It's pretty thin. It says they're extra thick on the box, but not to me. And I mean, I think I can just cut up a piece of felt myself um, if that's the case, because that's what it, it just looks like regular felt. There's nothing that I see that's added to the felt. So yeah, I did. I did pick it up to see what it was all about, though. Um, uh, the next item is this RVO, which is a repurchase. It is a tropical coconut uh, lip balm. So, yeah, I need to hold the products up longer. I mean, I can't even read them myself. Um, so I do apologize if I'm not holding them up long enough for you. These are some new Treaty Oil products that my Dollar Tree got in. I did pick up three three that they had. Um, I think there was like four or five different products. But uh, I did get the three. There's another one um, that I can't stop moving so I can read it. <laughs> Uh, but got that one. I'm pretty sure you've already seen them anyway, but this one has a little dropper and you might be able to read it. Um, but yeah, it's a little, uh, tree tea oil. And then the last one I picked up, well, that was the last one, I guess. So yeah, I got three three different tree tea oil products. This is a repurchase. This uh, is the AA batteries, uh, the eight pack, which is a better deal. So I went ahead and grabbed two of those. Those are great to use in your remotes, your clocks and your flashlights. So I grabbed two of those. I'll be glad when the uh, volume the audio comes back because this is harder than I thought it's either I can't I can't see it or it takes too long for the next product to come up and I don't remember what all I was saying okay these are two astrology books I picked up the Gemini one for me May 21st through June 21st and my birthday is May 21st so this is the 2021 virgin version and then I picked up the Pisces one for my sister, uh, February 20th through March 20th, and her birthday is March 13th. So, yeah, I picked up one for her and one for me. Let's see what that's all about. Okay, and the next item should be coming. <laughs> Some novelty pins. I collect novelty pins. This one has the gold barrel and the rainbow sparkly heart, which I thought was so cute. So I grabbed that one. And then I also grabbed a, I think it's a gold barrel one. Oh, no, that was a different video. I grabbed this one. It's the Jot Pin. Uh, it reminds me of the makeup brushes, but it has this little charm hanging off of it, a little heart. Um... But yeah, I grabbed this little rainbow colored uh, pen. And some more pens. I picked up these Super Glide Fashion pens. They are a, a sorted colors. You get three in the package. I picked those up for uh, journaling. You get a pink, a purple, and a blue. 
and it's by Cello. So I grabbed those to see how they write. I'm thinking I've purchased those in the past. I don't know if it's the same color, but I do think they look familiar. I don't know. They really do look familiar. I picked up two packages of these little uh, mini writing tablets. You get five tablets in the package. I just wanted some more colorful ones. I like to use those in my journals. So I grabbed the both of those. Okay, I picked up these marshmallows. This one might be the last item before the audio comes back in. I'm not sure. But when it comes in, I'll stop talking. Uh, but I got those for my hot cocoa bar for the Valentine's hot cocoa bar and candy station. So I'm going to put those in an airtight container um, for the bar. They can be used for the drinks or eating, eating them all by itself. So I went ahead and grabbed those. Okay. Well, I guess audio is not back yet. So I did pick up a phone case for my daughter a phone cover um, for her new phone I she has the iPhone SE but this one fix, fits the 7 and 8 I think and then the SE so I grabbed that for her oh candy picked up some Russell Stover's Pecan Deli Delight bar those are so good I wanted to get them out my system because I plan on eating a little healthier. So, yeah. I'm thinking our audio should be coming back here. Oh, at last I wanted to show you, before I show you the um, fairy garden stuff, was this package of pen pins i picked those up because they're different colors there's a green in there uh, like a hunter green a brown a yellow and an orange and there's just gel pins i know i've in the past picked up these but i picked up the pink the purple and blue i think it was but i thought i'd grab those because i don't have those colors like that dark darker color gel pins in my collection so those would be great for like trees and stuff like that. So now I'm showing you some of the fairy garden items that I picked up. This first package has the little figurines, the macaroons and a pegasus. And then this one here has cupcakes. I think those are similar or are the same as the ones from last year. These little drinks, I know I picked up some of these last year. So I got that, but I like to use those um, in my um, coffee station. So I will be incorporating them into Valentine's one. These are some little, um, I don't know if they're fairy ladies or wizard ladies or gnome ladies. I guess they look like little gnome girls, but I picked those up. Thought those were really cute. And then I picked up this little unicorn but I noticed the horn is broken off and I don't know if it was like that when I picked it up or if it happened on the way home but uh, yeah my eyesight you know I'm struggling with that so I'm it may have been like that and I just did not pay attention to it so I went ahead and got that then I found the little um, what is that cupcake house I forget what it said on the front but and then the little cotton candy stand I picked up that these would be really cute on the Valentine's tear trays so I got the little donut shop yeah I gotta work on holding these items up longer so you can get a good look at them I do apologize. And then I got the Ferris wheel. Okay, audio should be coming back. Look at the little, um, what was that, ice cream truck? And then the donut with the car, a little car donut on top. That's really pretty. Okay, what else did I get?
I just filmed this on uh, Wednesday, and I already can't remember half the things that was in it. But uh, I'm sorry, these are going up late. I was having technical difficulties, and as you see, I still am. So that is why I'm doing this voiceover. So I think that's it. Those were different. And now my fairy garden items, uh, the figurines I picked up. I picked up this one. It has the um, uh, macaroons and it has the little pegasus. So I got that package. I picked up the package of the little cupcakes. And I picked up the um, white sundaes or sweet drinks and then I picked up a package of the little um, what are they fairy gnomes or the little gnome ladies these were new this year so yeah got that one and then I picked up one oh the little unicorn's horn is off there so now it looks like a horse but um, I don't know if I did that or if I picked it up like that. You know, I'm still struggling with my vision. So, um, but it has a little fairy sitting on it. So I got that. And then I picked up some of the little sweet uh, shops. This one is the cake shop. And I picked up the cotton candy stand. I picked up the donut shop. These are really cute. I will add them with last year's items that I picked up. And I don't know, these look uh, nicer. The, the paint job on them is nicer than some of the previous ones. I uh, got the Ferris wheel. I got the little ice cream cart. And then the last item I picked up was the little donut car. thought that was super cute. So that's my haul, everyone. Um, if you have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell to be notified when I upload a new video. And as I said in the last video, I will be having surgery. So just put me in your prayers, y'all. I'd appreciate it. And I will pray for you as well. Uh, I love you and I appreciate your support. All your kind comments and um, giving me a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. Um, until the next one, everyone, stay blessed. Bye-bye.